Watch you guys got another video here for you. In this one we're going to be looking at how we can enable the F8 function key to enter safe mode. Now if you're unable to boot your computer to the Windows 10 desktop and you're having trouble uh, getting into safe mode then this video is for you. There is an option that will let you enable legacy advanced boot options menu which you may be familiar with when you was tapping F8 on a uh, Windows 7 operating system. This will uh, allow you to get into the advanced boot options menu. Well we can enable that function in a Windows 10 operating system and you can also do it in Windows 8.1 and Windows 8 and it's a useful thing to do if you're having trouble getting into safe mode. Now we're going to ena enable this uh, in a Windows 10 CD by booting up to that Windows 10 CD. Now you can either boot to a flash drive or a CD. You can also use a recovery uh, CD if you wish uh, or a flash drive but we're going to be using a Windows 10 CD to do this okay but you will need to change the uh, BIOS boot order to boot to CD or flash drive. So we're going to quickly change our boot order to CD-ROM drive in our BIOS and boot to that drive. Push enter. So we're going to boot to the CD here and let that boot up. Now you can boot to a CD or USB flash flash drive depending on what you've uh, set yours up as. Now once you get this booting up you will get this box here. Just click next here and then what you want to do here is come down to where it says repair your computer. Now once you get to this stage as you can see here uh, we can go into now troubleshoot and then we want to go into where it says advanced options. Now from here this is where you want to uh, go into command prompt and here we're going to change our uh, boot menu to legacy mode. Now once this is open we can now type in our legacy mode command. So the command you're going to want to type in here to enable uh, legacy mode for Windows 10 is this BC D edit just like so then space forward slash set and then space braces and then default just like so and then another brace on there and then space and then you want boot menu policy just like so and then space and then we want to type in there legacy just like that push enter and the operation uh, was completed successfully. Now what that's done is now change the uh, boot menu so when you tap F8 on your keyboard on Windows 8 it will boot to that um, safe mode uh, that way. Okay so if you was having trouble booting into safe mode uh, because of uh, some issue or something like that you can then use this method. Okay so if your PC is not booting up then you can change it here. Now if you want to put that back all you need to do here is you can push your cursor key up here and we're just going to take away the legacy mode here so it's exactly the same but then we're just going to change this to standard. Okay so that would be just like that and then we're going to put it back to standard mode and this will go back to the way it was before. And that's how you can enable the F8 key function inside a Windows 10 machine. Okay. So if you want to exit out of this you can now type in exit just like so push enter and this will bring you back to this location here you can either turn off your computer or you can continue to Windows 10. So I hope this one helps you out my name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk if you enjoy these videos guys then hit the like button also hit the subscribe button if you want to keep up to date and be notified when I upload new videos. If you've got any questions or anything like that, you can either leave them in the comments section below. I'll do my best to answer them for you. Or you can probably head over to my forum, which is probably the best place to go. If you've got any computer problems, questions, or any video requests, then you've probably got more chance of getting them answered over there. Okay, and the information's on the screen right now. So thanks again for your support, guys, and thanks for watching, and I shall see you again in the next video. Bye for now.